Nvidia is at it again. Just a couple of months after launching Ryzen's 7000 series CPUs, it's now the turn of the company's graphics card division to launch something new. Announced a few weeks ago by AMD CEO Lisa Su, these new graphics cards are the Radeon RX 7900XTX and RX 7900XT. The 7 at the start of the product number indicates that these are a whole new series of graphics cards, meaning a whole new architecture, RDNA 3, which marks quite a big departure from previous RDNA 2 based RX 6000 cards. Not only are each of the streaming processors and ray accelerators more efficient, there are also a whole lot more of them and this is made possible by two key advances. Firstly, making the GPUs out of 5 nanometer rather than 7 nanometer transistors. And secondly, like AMD's Ryzen and Epic CPUs, RDNA 3 GPUs are made from a collection of chiplets rather than a single monolithic die. This in turn allows AMD to use a cheaper 6 nanometer memory controller as its chiplets are separate from the processor chiplet. Inside the processor chipsets, the ray accelerators have also been given a big workover, with a new improved second gen design promising up to 1.8 times the performance of RDNA 2 GPUs. Other key improvements include all new AI accelerators, giving RDNA 3 GPUs over two times the single and half precision performance of RDNA 2 GPUs. The three levels of cache within the GPU have also been expanded, along with more or less doubling the bandwidth of the Infinity cache. Notably, AMD has managed to execute all of these improvements whilst keeping the power consumption of RDNA 3 GPUs within the same boundaries as the earlier RDNA 2 GPUs. Now, as you'd expect, the new RDNA 3 GPUs support existing AMD performance improving technologies such as SAM, which stands for Smart Access Memory. And this is for when you pair an AMD GPU with an AMD CPU. Plus Fidelity FX Super Resolution, which upscales games so you can enjoy higher frame rates in hard to run titles. So back to the cards themselves, what actually are they? Well, the RX 7900 XTX is the most powerful AMD graphics card to date. This ultra-fast graphics card packs in 6,144 stream processors, 96 ray processors, and 192 of the new AI accelerators. Equipped with 24 gigabytes of GDDR6 memory, the 7900 XTX is around 40% faster than the old 6900 XT and is a great choice for gaming at 4K or UWQHD. The RX 7900 XT is the next card down in the stack, packing in 5,376 stream processors, 84 ray processors and 168 of the new AI accelerators. Equipped with 20 gigabytes of GDDR6 memory, the 7900 XT is around 30% faster than the old 6900 XT and also makes it a great choice for gaming at 4K or UWQHD if the higher price 7900 XTX is a little out of your price range. You can view the new range of AMD Radeon RX 7000 series graphics cards based on the RDNA 3 architecture on our website, which is scan.co.uk. And we also have a whole new range of gaming PCs built by our 3XS systems, featuring this awesome new graphics card series. More information, including links, can be found in the description below. And why not let us know in the comments what you think of these new graphics cards and which one you're most interested in. Thank you.